early this morning, one of the residents went out front and there was a package on the front doorstep. They brought that package inside the residence and as they opened that package, both victims were in the kitchen and the package exploded, causing the injuries that resulted in the young man's death and the injuries to the adult female. Austin Police received a call today at 11.50 a.m. Our call came to the 6700 block of Galindo and we received multiple calls regarding an explosion that had taken place at a residence in the 6700 block. A few of those calls indicated that there was a victim that had been injured in this explosion. We're asking you to stay in your residence till we've had the opportunity to ensure that this neighborhood is safe. And if you have an emergency, please call 911. Give us the address so we can come in and safely escort you out. Uh, there have been reports in the media that this device was triggered by a tripwire, and we are here to say that that is a possibility. We now need the community to have an extra level of vigilance and pay attention to any suspicious device, whether it be a package, a bag, a backpack, anything that looks out of place, and do not approach it. Again, do not approach items like that, but instead call 911 to report it so we can go out and make sure that it is in fact safe. Majority was here at our MCARE bus, and what we do, we make sure they're treated um, medically, make sure they're okay, and then we're also taking statements as well. Um, any further information to get any of any help. There were nails, metals in the bomb, crisis was going to Austin. If you come across any suspicious object, do not touch it, do not move it, but contact 911. If you didn't order something, if you are not expecting a package, if it's something that doesn't have an official label on it, or really just not just a package itself, if there's anything out of the ordinary, we are asking the community to please call 911, let our officers come out, let us handle it. The suspect detonated a bomb inside the vehicle, knocking one of our SWAT officers back, and one of our SWAT officers fired at the suspect as well. The individual involved in this incident was a 24-year-old white male. The suspect is deceased uh, and has significant injuries from a blast that occurred from detonating a bomb inside his